Hey y'all, it's your favorite chef Elise, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I made these Philly cheesesteak egg rolls. This was so bomb. Just look at that cheese pull. Don't, don't play with it, don't be the size. First, you want to go ahead and start off by chopping down your onions completely, dicing them up into cubes. Next, we're going to go ahead and chop up our green peppers the same way as we chopped the um, onions, okay? So we're just going to chop that down as well. And it should look something like this. If it don't, you did something wrong, Bookie. Y'all already know that I use the Great Value Sirloin Philly Steak from Walmart because I'm giving y'all nothing but quick and easy recipes. So go in with your, well, of course, cook your sirloin steak down and go in with your onions and go in with your green peppers as well. Get that all sauteed down, add some garlic in there. And make sure y'all don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Go ahead and add you some of that W sauce because I don't know how to pronounce the name. Put some of that in there. Just a couple of drops is fine. I went in with some complete seasoning. And you, what they say? Season generously. Like if you ain't seasoned, I say if you ain't sneezing. If you ain't sneezing, it ain't seasoned. But I went in with some garlic powder, onion powder, and we're going to give that a good mix. Remember, taste as you go. Taste as you go. You have to taste this and adjust it to your preference. Okay, so we got that cooked down. And I cooked this like on medium heat, okay, guys, for about five minutes. We're going to go in with some mozzarella cheese. You want to go ahead and add some mozzarella cheese in there. Not too much, but we're going to give it like just like a little mix, but but not too not too much. We don't want it too cheesy at this point because we already going to add cheese on the egg roll. So, but you know, this this your egg roll. If you add as much cheese as you would like, okay? But you know, it should look something like this. I didn't add too much because I knew I was going to do the cheese on the egg roll. These are the egg roll wrappers, so let's go ahead and get right into it. First, I went ahead and laid down my provolone cheese, added my Philly cheese steak on top, and then I'm just going to add in a little bit more because your girl want to make sure that these egg rolls are big and plump. But look at me struggling because I should have used a different spoon, and that's what I get in the first place. Like, why would I use that spoon to transfer that over there? Like, but I be, y'all, I just be doing my thing, okay? So, not too much on this voiceover, not too much on none of this, because I'm going to get to where I need to be, okay? Just hold on. So, I'm adding in some more mozzarella cheese on top. But mind you, you guys can switch it. Y'all can do mozzarella first, then the Philly cheesesteak. Switch it however. No provolone, only mozzarella. However you want to do it. This is your egg roll. But I did use just water. I didn't use egg wash because I'm like, I can just use water. I'm not finna crack an egg just to crease some size. Nah, come on now. I'm not about to do all of that. I went over to the sink, ran my hand, and ran my hand right here because I'm I'm the one eating this, okay? I don't got time for this right now. But I'm going to show y'all how I wrap this up, okay? I'm going to show y'all. I'm just making sure that the edges are really wet. That way it can stick and don't move. Y'all see how I zoomed in a little bit? That way y'all can get a closer look because I really don't know how to really go into detail on how I did this. I had to watch a video of my own self to even do this. But this was very frustrating because I even had to use like more than one egg roll just to yeah i had to use two and three just to hold it together because i was just trying to make them thick because i didn't want to want them to look small i wanted them to look plump and big okay okay so i'm struggling a little bit because your girl is not chinese okay i'm from cali for real but yeah i got it so i managed to make it happen as y'all can see it's nice and cute don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell. You want to cook in some hot oil and cook them for about four to six minutes. And 
they should look golden brown just like this there you have it your very own philly cheese steak egg rolls now this cheese pull was something serious make sure y'all like comment and subscribe and hit that notification bell if you want to be notified every time i drop a quick and easy recipe okay i'll see y'all in the next video bye